Hi there, it's Sam from poodles.co.uk. Thank you very much for joining me. And on a Sunday, if you were here yesterday, you saw all the beautiful things that people have popped in the post to me. And today, and I did promise that I would have something else today. So today I'm sharing a bunch of cards that I've received from members of my team and from Stampin' Up and from my upline. So I thought I'd show them to you. So I've got them in no particular order. So I've got a card here from my upline. I hit my fifth anniversary right at the end of September. No, not at the end of September at all. No, at the end of March. So this came in the post from her, which is very sweet. So there's a five there that's been die cut out and the shapes on the front. So that's very nice. But she also, because a week later I hit my 700,000 career to date sales. So this came in the post shortly afterwards as well, which was so sweet. Very lovely. Um, and it's all die cut with the numbers. And I think we're losing the numbers, aren't we? We're either losing the letters or the numbers. And I want to say it's the numbers. So they're going, so grab them if you can. I also used my Stampin' Up! suitcase recently for the first time. Well, actually not that recently, but a little while back. And this was attached to the outside, which I hadn't spotted. And it says in here, congratulations on being one of the top performers in 2017. And so, yeah, it's a limited edition piece of luggage. And this was on the front. How cool is that? So you can see I had to snip it off. A bit gutted I had to cut it, but it was all around the, the tag. But... Uh, I received mine right at the beginning of, when did I receive it? Right just before Christmas, it was about four days before Christmas and then I haven't been away since then until we went away at the beginning of April and um, yeah so that was the first time I used it so how cute is that? Okay I've got some cards from my team here now I have, who's this one from? Janice. So with my team, I do a lot of recognition for them. I do it when they promote, uh, when they are recruiting, when they hit certain sales milestones in a month or sales amounts in a month, when, oh, when they do all sorts of things. And I send goodie parcels for their promotions and for the, and, you know, for when they promote or they hit qualified. So it's a big parcel full of all sorts of stuff. Um, but for other things, I send them vouchers and they're specially made by me and they can collect up the vouchers um, and they can collect as many as they like and then redeem them for anything they like. I used to send out embellishment packs, but it kind of got to the point where they were so overwhelmed with embellishment packs and treats like that, that actually they probably couldn't get used through them all. So I thought, so this, and it's been going for about five months now, I created this voucher system so they can collect as many as they want and they can redeem them for anything in the Stampin' Up! catalogue they want. And so a whole bunch of them decided to start redeeming their, their vouchers. I do, I do have one lady, she, is, she said she's saving for a unicorn. Stampin' Up! doesn't sell unicorns. So anyway, so what they need to do to redeem their vouchers is put them in the post to me with, a, with what they want. So there's no coding on the vouchers. So by putting them back in the post, I obviously am then cashing them in. And they're sending them in cards. I hadn't thought of that. They would send cards. So this is rather lovely. Sunshine is on its way. Janice, you are so right. It's here. It's blazing sunshine today. Who's this one from? This one's from Lorraine, which is lovely. Is that our paper? That is our paper, isn't it? I couldn't think for a second, is that on paper? So that's really sweet, so I like it, but it's on watercolour paper, which is unusual. Or maybe it's not, maybe it's, I don't remember what this kind of cardstock's called. It's sort of textured, oh, yeah, it's kind of textured cardstock. Uh, very lovely. Who's this one from? This one's from Wendy, and actually she put me um, a bookmark in as well. But that's lovely, all that glimmer, ooh. A little hand twisted rose and then a thank you very sweet but yes I got a I got a, a, a bookmark as well which is lovely and she's colored this with blends so this was celebration foiled cardstock and then blends over the top to change the color just lovely can you see it shimmering beautiful Who's this one from? So this one got got by kitten and then by husband oh actually this is another one from Janice Janice why did you send me two cards? This is, oh, okay. Janice, I have two cards. Did you redeem two sets of vouchers? Um, but yes, this one got chewed by kitten and then my husband helpfully sent a cup of coffee over it. So unfortunately it got a little bit squished there. But I love it. I like this. So this is repetitive stamping in the background that's been heat embossed in white and then it looks like a watercolour wash across it. The top of the coffee is vellum. I don't know if you can see that. So it's vellum over the foam 
so that's creating the sort of the top so this is a frappuccino is I think they're called and then a latte oh, she knows me so well love a latte so but I'm gutted that it's got a bit squished oh that's what happens when you let your husband sit at your computer who's this one from this one's from Jackie so Jackie's, uh, it's actually Janice and Jackie are both up in Scotland. And uh, yeah, this one came through. And we had done some team training after on stage using this stamp set and doing repetitive stamping. And actually, quite a lot of the girls did cash in their vouchers for the stamp set we'd used, which was Beautiful Bouquet. I couldn't think what the name of it was. That's so cool. Love it. So obviously Janice, I think Janice had done, well, she must have done this at the event because she cashed in for this stamp set. And then finally, I received this in the post from Stampin' Up! recently. I'm going on their incentive trip on a cruise to Alaska or around Alaska in July. And whenever we go on an Alaskan cruise, that, uh, on a cruise or a trip with Stampin' Up!, they spoil us rotten. Um, we get, well, obviously we get the trip all completely paid for. We get gifts every single night on our pillow, usually product gifts or logo merchandise. Um, we get, you know, to go into a hospitality suite and play for prizes every day. And every year, a small group of demonstrators gets invited to go to have dinner with the corporate team. Now, Alaska will be my, I think, my fourth trip. I've earned every trip I can since I joined, so I'm trying to think. Madeira Med, Thailand, Alaska. Yes, so that's right. <laughs> And I've never got to go and they've always chosen new earners, you know, or first time trip achievers. <laughs> I've never got to go. And now I have. I've been invited to join with my mum, who's my guest. and My dad's coming as well. So mum and I get to go and have dinner with the corporate team. And I'm so excited. I've been waiting a long time for this. <laughs> but it's beautiful. I love it. All the way from our home office. Just gorgeous. Dry embossing there. We've got... Uh, Die cut, is that a die cut shape? No, it's not. It's one of our punches, isn't it? Punch out shape. We've got stamping, little punches here. We've got um, crinkle ribbon. We've got punches in the background, little twists of sequin trim. Just lovely. So I'm really excited. I get to go for dinner. Oh, lucky me. Anyway, I hope you like all of those. I'm very, very touched that um, the team have sent these, but I can't. Thank you. Thank you for your part in inspiring this card, showing all of our gorgeous. I think this was just a thank you card from Janice, that one. Um, so, yeah, but I love it when I get stuff in the post. As I said yesterday, that it's always very humbling. Oh, look, you can tell the Stampin' Up! style, can't you? Two Stampin' Up! cards. Um, yeah, so it's always very humbling when I get stuff in the post because, you know, I send lots of stuff out in the post and it's nice to have it back. So when I said to the girls, you know, just post your vouchers back to me, it didn't occur to me they'd send me cards. <laughs> but they have. Lucky me. Anyway, I hope you find this inspiring. Um, my team are absolutely amazing. I have, oh, about 150 people direct to me. I think it's about 370 across my whole team. And I send out hundreds of bits of mail. You do not want to know how many vouchers I've sent out. Okay, I'll tell you, it's about 700 vouchers have gone out and not very many people have cashed them in yet. They're all waiting for the new catalogue. Um, so I send hundreds of pieces of mail every single month. So it's so lovely to get stuff back in the post. Um, you know, I send out to my team probably about 160, 170 pieces of mail and then to my customers probably another 170 as well. So, And then when I'm sending out a catalogue, so we're probably pushing 400 bits of post every month that I put out. So getting stuff back is just amazing. And yeah, lucky me. So a card for my fifth anniversary and a card for my 700th came in the mail to me from my upline. And these are coming back from my team to me because I rewarded them. Anyway, thank you ever so much for joining me. Back tomorrow with um, regular videos, but I thought I'd surprise you this weekend. I'm working on catalogues just to let you know. So I'm filming this on Thursday, um, and obviously you're seeing this a couple of days later on Sunday. I received all of my catalogues in the mail, well, in the mail through UPS yesterday, 35 boxes. So it's almost a thousand catalogues have arrived. Um, Yesterday I got cracking. We got them all out of the boxes and then all out of their packaging. They're all over my husband's office. If you go and have a look on my Facebook page, uh, Poodle's Papercraft, 
and you'll see the photos he cleared a big chunk of his garage for me and he actually hoovered it yes my husband has carpet in his garage he lives in the he lives right below me and when I ripped out the carpet in here to put new flooring down he took the carpet because obviously it's the same size what man has carpet in his garage but yeah he hoovered it wiped down and cleaned scrubbed all of his work surfaces so that it was spotless for me to work on catalogues I've started putting my details on the back um I've got my um letter written up to go inside it and then over this weekend so where we're at now the plan is or the plan uh, this uh, on Thursday is that this weekend the family and I will help we'll put together and get them all packaged up but if you'd like a copy I can send them to the United Kingdom France Austria Germany and the Netherlands and I have them in French German and English so go to my blog poodles.co.uk on the right hand side you will see click here to get a free copy of a catalogue and just let me know so those are the five places I can send them and those are the three languages I can send them in if you're in America Canada New Zealand Australia or Japan you'll need to find a demonstrator there to send you a catalogue I can't do that but I do send mine for free I don't charge for my catalogues um, I choose not to because I dislike being charged for a catalogue myself so I don't charge for them and I don't char charge for postage either get them out in the post for free anyway thank you so much for joining me Hope to speak to you soon. Bye.